Hey, this is Jay Nicholas for the Oregon Fly Fishing Blog. We are doing a me mega video shoot today. This is, I should show you what we got here. This is, uh, this is going to be a big intruder. Senyo's intruder shank. Senyo's intruder wire. Who's this Greg Senyo anyway? This is American possum uh, spun in a dubbing loop. This is cactus chenille. This is an EP Foxy brush. I'm going to use, by the way, I'm, I'm trying to keep you away from the pain of having to watch 20 minute videos, you know. I apply the Foxy brush. The reason I'm using it, aside from the fact that it's, it's very fishy, this, this is, uh, this Foxy brush, this collar here will stand out and help keep my wing nice and flared. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna be adding quite a quite a few materials here. This is a marbled this is marbled fox tail. I'm gonna take out some of the guard hairs. I make this. Uh, I've got my trailer my stinger wire fairly long. This is kind of a cool color. Combination. Look at that red, blue, and gold. Woo! Um, this marbled fox is really nice material to work with. Sometimes I tie in the under fur first and then the guard hair is over. I'm not doing that right now. It, it, this fur does compress, but there's that little bit of insecurity, fly insecurity, that makes me want to put a little bit of cement on there. Now let's throw on some holographic flash abu. Nice little chunk to match that gold. By the way, this isn't this is not a straight gold color. I honestly don't remember the color. I picked it out by hand because it looked so great. I'll look it up. We'll post it at the end of the blog. But I do remember this. This is Polar Flash, and it's darker. A whole variety of colors. It's rainbow-ish. I like that right over the top. Flies like this fish well for many fish. I wouldn't say for summer steelhead, but if you're fishing the Dean for spring Chinook, you're fishing the Connect Hawk, you're fishing the Great Lakes, think you're in business. Get some extra select marabou, which means it's a little bit more select than regular select. So this is extra select. These are frankly bigger flies I've been tying here recently than I normally fish. But I've been having some great conversations with some friends who fish up in Alaska and who fish that slid forward. That's going to be OK, though. Fish the Great Lakes areas, and they fish really big flies. They swing up steelhead on really big flies. Of course, Alaska, they're fishing kings on these big intruder style flies. So, and pike and musky and whatnot. So I figured I'd throw some of these together to have some fun. I'm probably gonna wind up with a blue tongue here pretty quick. So let's try those jungle cock eyes. And I, I'm gonna turn the vise on its side there. Try to pick a length that looks reasonable. I'm going to trim while I'm at it. My buddies down at Hairline were involved in developing this product. 
A lot of input, a lot of guide input, a lot of tire input. They come off clean. They are two-sided and they are durable. I'm doing this to try to match the size, the, the length. I think I actually had it right about the first time. Let's see, are those? Yeah, it looks pretty good. Sometimes you get lucky. Instinct. I'm going to throw on a little dash of pink laser dub. Because I do like, I like a little bit of pink right at the front of my blue highlighted flies. I'm crowding the eye there just a little bit, but you'll forgive me. I know you will. That's what happens sometimes. There goes my bobbin, retracted. Here you have it. Great big intruder. Fish it anywhere big fish live. Go tie a bunch. Thanks.